In this video, we use 2818 Win ZVZ Wave Gateway, ZV9101 FACCTC CCT LED Dimmer, and SR ZV9001 T4 CCT UCCT Touch Panel for setup. Wiring the three devices correctly, power on them. Download Easy Home Smart Home app from App Store or Google Play. Then connect your phone's Wi-Fi to Easy Home. The password is 0123456789. Before add the dimmer or touch panel to a Z-Wave network, you must make sure that they do not belong to any Z-Wave network. Please remove them from previous network first if they belong to any Z-Wave network. Please refer to the part exclusion in Factory Reset for how to remove them from a Z-Wave network. Now add the dimmer to Z-Wave network. Enter the Easy Home app. Select Z-Wave. Tap the plus button create a new room and enter the room. Tap the plus button to search a new device. Triple press the prog button on the dimmer. It will be set into inclusion mode automatically and waiting to be included. Added a new device, we can control the lighting with the app now. Before add the dimmer or touch panel to a Z-Wave network, you must make sure that they do not belong to any Z-Wave network. Please remove them from previous network first if they belong to any Z-Wave network. Please refer to the part exclusion in Factory Reset for how to remove them from a Z-Wave network. Now add the touch panel to Z-Wave network. Tap the plus button to search a new device. Press and hold down all on off button over 3 seconds. The touch panel control will be set to inclusion mode and waiting to be included. The LED indicator blinks 6 times quickly to indicate successful inclusion. Now bind the touch panel to the dimmer. Select the group, select and tap a device from the unbind device list. Here the dimmer is displayed as a CCT device in the list. Tap it to bind to the touch panel. Then the dimmer will appear in the bind device list, which means successful binding. Before the touch panel quits inclusion mode, the LED indicator will stay solid on. Please be patient to wait LED indicator to turn off, it may take 25 seconds. We can control the lighting with the touch panel now. In this part, we'll show you how to exclusion and reset device to factory default setting. For touch panel, there are two exclusion methods. Method 1, exclusion from gateway. Tap reset in the wall switch option. Press and hold down all on off button for over 3 seconds. The wall controller will be set to exclusion mode and waiting to be excluded. Then LED indicator turns on and shows three short blinks and one long blink to indicate successful exclusion. Method 2, Reset to Factory Default Setting. Press and hold down Inclusion Exclusion button on the touch panel for over 8 seconds. LED indicator blinks slowly to indicate successful factory reset. For dimmer, there are two exclusion methods. Method 1, Exclusion from Gateway. Tap Reset in the wall switch option. Immediately triple press the prog button, then the dimmer will be excluded to the network. Method 2, Reset to Factory Default Setting. Press and hold down the prog button for over 10 seconds, the dimmer will be reset to factory defaults. 